Hope Bearden lives in the city of Early. She gets nervous when people knock on her door. There's times if I'm home alone and somebody rings my doorbell and I'm not expecting them, I simply don't answer the door. She says a flooring company salesman visited her a few years ago. And they wanted to come in and clean my floors and I mentioned that I had just gotten hardwood and I didn't want them coming in and they told me that well my neighbor next door had let them come clean her hardwoods and I knew for a fact that she had carpet. Early police are telling these salesmen to knock it off. In order to solicit door-to-door -door, you have to obtain a permit through the city of Early. Uh, you have to apply for that 10 days prior. The business also has to pay a $50 fee. You have to provide information so that we can research and make sure this is not a sex offender or, or someone with warrants. Some have decided to be proactive and make their own no solicitation signs. You'll see this at a retirement community right by Early City Park. The Chamber of Commerce says this ordinance isn't bad for business. I'm all for anyone who wants to promote commerce as long as it's a legitimate business and they're following all the guidelines and rules and regulations that any other business has to follow. Bearden hopes the push by police will keep door-to-door -door salesmen away from her door. In early, Joshua Piguero, KTexas News.